Hello readers, I'm bringing you a story today from the perspective of an Aboriginal author in Australia. It is a story that is not a narrative, it's very poetic but it's not a poem, it's closer to persuasive text because the author is calling on us to understand the importance of listening. Around to the end I'll explore some of those concepts a bit more. This is the story called Listen. Listen by Duncan Smith and Nicole Godwin. With paintings by Jandamara Cad, walking the same track, filling our footprints with knowledge for a better future while remembering the past pain of my people. To my clever and creative mum Pam, who supports everything I do. This is an invitation to healing and walking together the proper way. One heart, one people, one mob. Listen, and you will hear the voices of ancestors speaking to us, guiding us. Listen carefully to the voices of First People, seeking respect, laying bare the deep scars of the past through truth-telling, leading us to healing. Listen deeply to Elders, speaking the first languages of country, telling dreaming stories that fill our hearts. talking about what treaty means. Sharing song lines. Generously leading us on the path to knowledge of culture, of country to understand, to reconcile. Listen with openness to voices of the past and present telling their stories, guiding us. Walking together in the footprints of ancestors. Here is a bit more information about the book. As a proud Kabi Kabi brother, Kerry Neal plays this ancient instrument. Young Bowie is mesmerized by the vibration and the sound. I see this image as a beautifully symbolic representation of the younger generation connecting with something that is part of the oldest living culture in the world. Walking with the ancestors, as Uncle Waronga Dungi shares in ceremonial dance, he is not alone. He walks in the footsteps of thousands. Country is within. This painting is about showing the spiritual connection between ourselves and country. Our connection to country is integral to our sense of identity and wellness on every level. This painting celebrates Jackie Sandy, proud Kabi Kabi woman, and her connection to country, especially to the mighty Bunya tree. Listen.